It's an announcement that's shaken the heartthrob adoring world to its core. Ryan Gosling plans to take a break from acting. In the nine years since his breakout role in The Notebook, this square-jawed Canadian has won legions of fans with his boyish good looks, a brooding demeanor, and Oscar-nominated talent. But as ABC's Dick Watt discovered, there's something far more mysterious about Gosling's appeal. I waited for you for seven years. Now it's too late. It's a headline that's breaking hearts. Ryan Gosling, sensitive star of The Notebook. I wrote you every day for a year. He's taking a break from acting. A riatus. Women in particular are weeping. Remember the protests when he was not voted world's sexiest man? Who do we want for 2011 people's sexiest man of the year? Ryan When do we want it? Now! That was anger. This, this is emptiness. No, I'm just going to snuggle with him. Don't leave Ryan. So sad, he's so good. Can I kiss him? You can, yeah. <laughs> on, a, oh, on the cheek? On the cheek. Right if he's happy, I'm happy. I'm supportive. <laughs> An enterprising British website has set up a helpline, the Goz Line. Joe, it's not going to be easy. It's going to be really hard. This, by the way, is Ryan in the notebook. And we're going to have to work it just every day, but I want to do that because I want you. I want all of you forever, you and me, every day. <laughs> Please leave your message after the tone. Hi, Ryan. It's Nick at ABC. Um, we're having problems today getting some of the female uh, members of staff motivated. I personally do not understand the appeal, so I walked around the office in search of the gosling essence. What does that do to you? Gives me a tingle. A tingle? Yes. Hello there. <laughs> I'd be happy to put that at my cubicle when this is done. It's very hot. He's fit, he's tan, he's blonde and blue eyes. What is it about him? I mean, he's not very manly. He doesn't have much body uh, hair. Manly is out. This is much better. He's like, physically, he's the, the best looking, best body. Manly is out. Yes, manly is out. There is a wildly popular internet meme on which women basically transplant their dreams onto the facade of Gosling. Specifically, his perfect abs, like this one. Hey, girl, I had a dream last night. We went antiquing and got your mom a really nice gift. It was pretty intense. And he has a sense of humour. I write them, actually. <laughs> it's my site. Gosling got in on the joke in an MTV interview a couple of years ago. Hey, girl, happy Thanksgiving. I'm thankful for your yams and sweet potato pie. He's no Reynolds, he's no Schwarzenegger, but Gosling is the leading man of our times, which perhaps says something about our times. He's Canadian. He loves his mum. He can actually act with award nominations for serious films like Half Nelson and Blue Valentine. But he's not afraid to dive headfirst into rom-com territory and any woman between the ages of 16 and 60 can quote this scene. Crazy stupid love. They can quote it verbatim. Seriously? It's like you're photoshopped. Men are also in his thrall. I feel threatened and a little bit aroused, which is, <laughs> which is worse, I think. <laughs> and in real life, he's broken up fights. When people say that they don't like Ryan Gosling, the first question, can you see? Do you have eyes? Like, are you kidding me? Like, look at this, look! He's the everyman. He's what you wish you had, but don't. Are you married? Yes, I am. I dialed the Gos line once more. I've spoken to a lot of people. I now understand what you're all about. I get you. I want you. We need you. Come back, dude. Come back. Our last chance to see him for now is the place beyond the pines out this week. Your skill set? Shit damn. Everybody wants to live. Put your hands in the fire. Come back soon, Ryan. And don't come back as a goose. Everybody loves the little gosling. I'm Nick Watt for Nightline in New York.